What's going on everyone? Welcome back to part two of the Pro Debut Hobby Box. Um, if you want to see part one, if you didn't check it out, you can check it out up here. I'll leave it in the link below as well. Sorry about our breath. We've run up the stairs. Um, I don't know why. I had to run down to the door, which I nearly missed a postman. So, uh, as you can tell, I am in peak health and fitness. Physical fitness. I don't know where I'm going with this, to be honest with you. Um, what did we get in the last one? I can't actually remember. We did get an uh, autograph, I think. So we've got eight packs. Three more autographs to find, because you get four in these hobby boxes, which is awesome. For the price as well, which is... Uh, yeah, Pro Debut is the, one of the best products, I think. And the cards actually look way better than uh, like normal top flagship, I think. I say it every time, but yeah, the uh, matte and gloss like mix looks fantastic. The only thing I don't like actually, not into these uh, inserts this year, the brick by brick, but they're okay. But yeah, it's nothing crazy. But I know uh, from last time, Pro Debut is awesome, but it does have some pretty naff inserts sometimes. So we've got Eric Pena starting it off. We've got Gabriel Arias. And Xavier Edwards pulled his autograph, actually. There's another one. Ian Lewis is uh, the next autograph for the Marlins. So we can... Oh, nearly completely destroyed that card. Put Ian Lewis at the back. We've got Jorbit Venus. Hopefully I said that right. There's Marcelo Mayer. That's one of the uh, big names to look for now in like Bowman and Pro Debut. We've got Cameron Corley. Jose Ramos, and that's it for that pack. I always forget there's little, little, there's less cards in here. Why have, I don't know if I'm being, if I'm completely missing something here. Let me just do this pack and then I'll say what I am looking at. Oh man, I've got a really itchy nose. There's Gabriel Rodriguez. Oh, Ruben Ibarra, that's definitely a name we should be keeping on. Colby Mayo. Cooper Bowman, and we've got Deion Sanders insert. Awesome. Man, Deion Sanders was great. Oh God, I don't know my itch, my nose is so itchy. Jordan Groshans, Jose Miranda, he's now with the Twins, and Gunnar Hogluno. Yeah, I wonder why some of them have the Pro Debut logo and some don't. Is that their first card, kind of like Bowman? Let me know. I, I mean, I can just look it up after this video, which I probably will, but I only just noticed that. It's probably something really straightforward as well. Jordan Walker. There's Jose Rodriguez. Or Elvis Martinez. There's Michael Triana. And you've got a pink, Christian Encarnacion Strand. And that is out of 199. Cool, that number is right up there on the edge. I wonder why they put it so damn high. Usually they have it like down here. I think. I'm trying to find, let's find a. Of course, the first card I pick up doesn't have a number on it. Oh, I guess uh, it is a little bit different. They, are, they can't have it that low because it's got like a black border, that's why. Well, there we go. That's why. That's answered my question. But yeah, there's where you've got a pink. Uh, Cooper Kinney, got Austin Wells, and Nick Gonzalez as well. Might have to get a... I'd love to get a jumbo box of Pro Debut, because you get, I think, a lot more numbered or coloured cards in there. And do you get Chrome as well? I can't remember now. I think you do. Yeah, I think you do get some Chrome cards in there. Warm and Bernabelle, that's a great name. Justin Foscu. And you got Jordan Wicks and Connor Norby, Ian Moller, and Noel V. Marte. Who did he get traded to? I can't remember. The Mariners traded him though. Was it in the. Mm, I don't think it was in, um, in the Luis Castillo trade, was it? I can't remember. No doubt you'll tell me down below. So. Or I can just look it up again after the video. Hey, we've got green. Oh man, Joe Hendrick Pinago. 
Penango. What's that number? That? 99. And that's going to go in the Cubs PC as well. Hopefully I pronounced his name right. I probably butchered it completely. There's Carter Jensen. Brett Beatty. I might see him have a full season, hopefully, next year. Because um, he got injured quite re no, quite soon after coming up, I think. So he didn't get to see it. But he looked awesome, though, when for the few games he did play. We've got Andrew Painter. Joshua Byers. Jordan Viaris. Jordan Lawler, that's a definite name to keep an eye out there. Another brick by brick, Henry Davis. I'm sure he'll be up in the big league soon. There's Jake Fox, Alexander Canario, and Grayson Rodriguez. Did he get called up at the end of the season? Well, man, I can't remember. My brain is like a sieve. I don't remember anything. I can barely remember what I did yesterday. There's Raquel De Castro. And yeah, Heston Kirstad. Ryan Holgate, Max Muncy. Hey, there's our next one. Alberto Rodriguez for uh, Everett Aquasock. So he's in the Mariners, uh, Mariners minor league. So that's two autographs. We've got one more to find. There's Ellie De La Cruz, Nolan Jones, and Luis Rodriguez. All right, last pack of this part of the pro debut. Brain in the corners of the cards, getting them out. Garcia, we've got Denzel Clark and a Derek Lee insert. I need to find out what design this is. I cannot remember. I'm pretty sure I said in the last video. There's Ryan Bliss, Lonnie Witt. Is it White? Oh no, White, sorry, not. There's Colton Cowser. And that's it. That's the end of that pack. That's the end of that part. So that's a pretty good return. Two autos. We've got the Ian Lewis and Alberto Rodriguez. And then the pink and green inserts as well. And the brick by brick and the two uh, legends inserts as well, Derek Lee and Dion Sanders. So pretty good second part, I would say. Let me know what you think in the comments. Smash the like and subscribe if you like what you see and you're not already subscribed. It would be greatly appreciated. And I'll see you on Friday.